that? Uh, Mystery Lake. Where? Uh, right outside the Hydro Dam. Just behind me is the Hydro Dam and those two little trailer uh-huh. things. So, like, I found the the trees with the markings here. So I kept, uh, I was staying in one of those shacks and I just kept going out every day to try and find one. I just found one right over there. See? Yeah, I, I checked that place. There's the marked tree. And now I have a gun. I had a gun and I was shooting it with grenades. That's the one that fell next. I had like five, had five marked trees. Now, should I try and sneak up or just charge at him and try and shoot him before he gets me? Uh, I would try to take a sneak shot and try to get a shot on it if it starts to charge. Like, get as many shots. Yeah, obviously. Like, get as close as can get a sneak shot. How's my temperature? My temperature's going down, but I... Just don't let it sneak. And when he's... He's probably close enough to get a shot. Nah, I can get close there. Especially when I'm crouching. I've been way closer to the deer. And then hopefully when he, like, kicks up, you can get him down. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. He didn't, he didn't, like, go up. He just started charging right away. Yeah, that's probably because I shot him right away. Ouch. Yeah, maybe it would have been better to learn. And then he did that. Ouch. Broken rib. Maybe you should have done Maybe I should. Where'd he go? Do I still have my gun? What's your health at? Ten percent. Are you kidding me? Oh boy. Go. And it is still. Oh no, I wasn't ten percent. Never mind. Ah, oh, that was a waste. <laughs> <laughs> it just does you. You're not groggy like that when you first wake up. That's got lots of health. Yes. Yes. Is he dead? Nope, nope, he's not there. There! There we go! He filmed it. Yes! This is all being recorded. For Caleb. There we go, Caleb, I got him. Second moose sighting, first kill. Four bullets. Did I use four bullets? Yeah, I think. Oh, yeah, yeah, I did. 39 kilograms? <laughs> oh, yeah, it's a lot of meat. Good. Uh, I should probably... Yeah, but I should probably start a fire first, because otherwise I'm going to... Oh, it's too windy. Too windy. Doesn't the... Uh, moose body block the wind? Wait, which side is it coming from? It's coming from that direction. Oh. oh. <laughs> so, moose body is going to block it. It's blocking it. No, it's not like it puts a fire in here. Uh, how long does that take to quarter up? Two hours. Two hours. Can I cancel it halfway through? Oh wait, no, it's the same either. Nope, no good. Okay, that lowers that. Wait, I'm exhausted. Oh, right, I'm still damaged from the broken ribs. Uh, two bandages. I think that's warmed up now, it's not blowing. But I'm still going down. And painkiller, correct? I said four painkillers. Yeah, I think so. Oh, no, no, we're good. It was just two painkillers. I think you automatically take two painkillers every time you do it anyway. Mm. Uh, oh, right, I'm exhausted because I took the. Energy stem. So can you just drink coffee? Yep. Yeah, coffee actually gives you like a like five percent, ten percent boost to your fatigue. Maybe so. Oh yeah. Go ahead and get the rest of them without freezing to death. Ah, <laughs> come on. Although, it's very short distance to my cabin where I'm keeping all my extra supplies, but still. 40 kilograms of meat? I don't know how I'm supposed to carry that all. I'll just quarter it up and then take it there. Well, quarter, bit by bit. quarter is going to be heavier. Then, it's going to be heavier. No, oh, yeah. Well, still, it's really short, so I can just take short trips. Oh my goodness, it takes forever to click up all the meat. 
I'm going to guess, yeah, that takes way too long to quarter it. Still exhausted, but... There we go. Nice. 